the toss, which was a visual distraction to no end. How he did that, I don't know. Here we go again. This time it's a 177. But that's uh, Peter's newest low out is now 91 under pressure. <laughs> Flash start in hand. Well, I said he had to win four legs on the trot from 5-2 behind. You can only win one of them at a time, though, John, and he's put the first brick in the wall. There's a nine darter on here. Oh, my! Well, it would have been all if it, that would have been on if that dart had clung on to the treble 20 bed. He's unlucky, and he knows it. Well, I, in, those, in these situations, I always still kind of cheer for the, the ten dart leg with that bounce out just a, you know a, a kind of full perfect game yeah ghost nine data and he's still on for that i remember adrian lewis had one at the grand slam one with ghost nine data ten data with a bounce out and it's on here john as you alluded to he's got 177 140 with a bounce out of the treble 20 180 to leave 24 after nine and that 24 is for the match he had an epic world semi-final against Michael Smith in 2019. He's trying to reach a semi-final against Michael Smith in the Premier League, and he has done so. Nathan Ashmore wraps up a really authoritative victory over Peter Snakebite Wright by six legs to three. Coming up next, we've got Welsh home...